With Andre Kronia quitting crypto, you might be wondering if you can even still use your own finance. Well, yes, you can, and I'll show you how. What's up? My name is Caroline, and this is Weapon Progress, where you'll learn how to make passive income with cryptocurrencies. In this video, I'll show you how you can earn up to 140% APY on your own finance. Now, while the API might not be as high as on other platforms and it might fluctuate a lot, your own finance is one of the most established phantom projects. So that means an increased amount of security. Now, you might be thinking, hold on, but haven't we just read yesterday that Andre Kronia is quitting crypto and that he and his business partner quit 25 phantom projects among those Yearn Finance, right? So yes, this is Antonel's tweet and he mentions that Yearn Finance is one of the projects that will be the, the services that will be terminated on the 3rd of April. Now, in my opinion, this was a very confusing tweet and uh, also maybe some misinformation or it could be perceived in a wrong way because from my understanding, if we look at another tweet from Bantec, you can see that Andre hasn't even been working on your own finance anymore. So he stopped working there uh, over a year ago. And also what I, from my understanding, what, what's happening is that the front end might be closed. I'm not even sure about that because if both of those developers haven't been working with your own finance anymore, I don't see how they could influence that. But what could happen is that they'll that they'll shut down the front end, but the code is open source and the project is still solid. And there, there as you can see here, there are 50 full-time people and 140 part-time contributors working on your own finance. So this won't just be terminated or won't just dissolve into nothing. Now, if you want to take your crypto strategy to a whole new level and actually buy when whales are buying, aka at the bottom, then you need to join our free masterclass. This is where you'll learn how to use on-chain metrics that have made and me over $50,000 in profit. So if you're tired of missing the bottom, then go down in the description, click on the first link and sign up for our free masterclass. You'll then receive a personal invitation for the masterclass very soon. All right, let's dive in. All right, so I'm now on Yearn Finance's homepage. And before we get started, what we always need with those DeFi protocols and platforms is a MetaMask wallet. So I already have that installed, but if you don't have that yet, I'll leave a tutorial about how to install that linked on top of my head. So check that out first and then come back to this video. Otherwise, connect your wallet on the top right. And then what you need to do in order to see the staking options is go to vaults. And what you'll see straight away, what's a big advantage compared to LP farming is that you can do single, single coin staking, meaning you only need that one coin, you put that in there. And what's also really cool is that you earn the same token and it's auto compounding. So what that means is, if you, for instance, uh, if we take Boo as an example, you put that Boo in there and then you get more Boo as rewards and that get put back on top of your initial Boo capital that you put there. So that gets put on top and that means you earn even more APY because your capital gets bigger the longer you keep it in there. Now it does that in a way that is explained up here. It says, your tech helps maximize yield through shifting capital, auto compounding and rebalancing. And it does that by using other staking or farming platforms and always adapting to the best possible strategy to get you the highest rewards. Now, if you scroll down here, you'll see that the APYs change a lot. So if you've seen the phantom staking overview video, you'll have noticed that the APYs wise were actually a bit higher back there. And I guess the main reason right now is that there's a lot of fear in the phantom ecosystem, meaning a lot of people get out of the ecosystem and that's why the APYs drop. Now, to be honest, I still think Phantom is a solid ecosystem and has a lot of good projects and a lot of skilled people working on it. So just because two people are quitting doesn't mean that the whole ecosystem is worthless all of a sudden. But what probably will happen is this will take some time to cool off, to cool down, and then capital will come back into the ecosystem and then those APYs will rise again. But you need to keep that in mind, those APYs change a lot. So as you can see, Boo is by far the best option at the moment because you earn a pretty Pretty good APY on this one. Now, Boo is SpookySwap's native token, and SpookySwap is 
Phantom's biggest decks. So that's generally a token that is in high demand, but keep in mind those tokens are volatile and it's not Phantom that you stake in here. If you, if you want to stake Phantom, you'd have to choose Wrapped Phantom and you get 4.5% APY, or you could choose one of the, the stable coins to get a more stable return. But then again, the APYs are much smaller. So I'll show you how to do it with Boo. So first of all, you can click on that to get a bit more information on that. So as you can see on the right here, I currently don't have any Boo in my wallet. So I'll quickly show you how to buy Boo on SpookySwap itself. So you'll go to SpookySwap. I'll leave the links in the description below so you can just head there. Then go on Swap. And then you see it automatically chooses Phantom to Boo. So as an example, let's just swap five Phantom and you, I'll get 0.47 Boo. So you can click on swap here, then confirm that in your MetaMask. Okay, so that has been confirmed. So we can now go back to Yearn and you can see I've now got 0.47 Boo in here. So what you need to do is you need to put that into the vault, into that staking vault. And first we need to approve that. So again, your MetaMask wallet needs to prove that this that you'll want to stake it in there. Okay, once this is approved, you can click on max here, unless you want to stake less, then just choose that, and then click on deposit. And then again, confirm that in your MetaMask. Okay, so that transaction has been completed. And now if you go back to the main vault page, you'll see now that on top here, you'll see your deposits. So you see that I've put 0.47 BOO in there around 146% APY and also the value. And then over time, you'll see how much you've earned and that again will be auto compounded. Now, if you wanna withdraw it, all you have to do is either click on withdraw here or again, click on the token itself and then you just get the whole information, the whole information page again and then click on withdraw here. And then it's just the other way around. So you go from wall to wallet, to your wallet. Again, you have to click on max, and then it's already proved, so all you have to do is click on withdraw here, and then that gets put back in your MetaMask wallet. So yeah, that's basically all you need to know about how to use your own finance. I think that's one of the easiest platforms to use ever, and it's a really nice way to earn passive income because it's also auto compounding. So you can choose which kind of, of tokens you want to put in there and then earn more of that token. But yeah, other than that, there's nothing more you need to know about that. Now I will come out with the other phantom staking tutorials in future weeks. So don't forget to subscribe so you'll get notified when those come out as, as well. Some of those have really high APYs, which is really nice, but then again, they're much riskier. So it always depends on how much risk you really, really want to take and that usually determines how much rewards you can get as well. If you like this video, hit the like button down below, share with your friends and be sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.